My name is Samantha Banislot. I'm a health sociologist at the University of Oxford. My work is on um, what people think about vaccination. Most people get on with vaccination um, without a fuss, so the majority of people are supportive of vaccination. Uh, there are a smaller group, um, normally about 2-3% in a lot of countries where uh, there is uh, opposition to vaccination and they might be very vocal about that and try to influence other people. One concern that people have is that vaccines overwhelm the immune system, which just isn't backed up by the scientific research, suspicion of powerful groups who might be behind vaccination. And this kind of feeds into conspiracy theories about, say, governments and pharma companies, international organisations, who people believe that um, they might have bad intentions for wanting to pr promote vaccination. There are currently over 100 vaccines in development for COVID-19 and they're all taking slightly different approaches. So to develop a vaccine for um, a new pathogen, uh, you build on previous work that's taken place. COVID-19 vaccine will have to go through the same um, steps of regulatory approval as any vaccine. And that means that um, the regulatory authorities will be paying close attention to um, whether it meets all the safety and efficacy tests that it's gone through.